What up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna to be going over the Flextone WTF Grunter. As with all of our review videos we're gonna be doing from now on. If it's a product I like, I'm gonna be giving one away to a viewer for free if we can complete a challenge at the end of the video. So make sure you stick around for that. It's a deer call that is not only supposed to be a buck, but you also have buttons that will change it from being just a buck call, just a normal buck grunt, to a doe or a fawn. All right, so opening it up, it comes with a lanyard. That'll use that. So the entire call is uh, soft, basically like a rubber. It's kind of interesting. I'm sure that'll help with not making as much noise when you're trying to use it. Yeah. Let's see how it sounds. So that's your standard buck grunt. Try not to judge me too much for my calling. My calling is typically about as effective for deer as it is for everything else. Oh, it does separate for cleaning, I guess. That's interesting. I didn't know you could take it apart. It also falls. Gravity does have an effect on it. Let's see how much I just messed it up. Those buttons are just going to push on the reed, changing the pitch of it. That's an interesting idea. Yeah, so, yeah, you got your standard buck. And we got our dough, which just by pushing this down, I'm guessing all the way. And then the top button is supposed to mimic a fawn. I kind of feel like that should have stoppers somewhere in it. But I'm sure just by getting practice with it and getting used to it, you can probably get real good. The bottom chamber also does a snort. I, I don't know if I'd ever use that in the woods because the only time I've ever heard that, that's been a sign of bad, bad things. Oh no, it's, it's, it's pretty cool. I like the uh, idea of having multiple calls in one call. I'm sure I am terrible at calling because, well, I'm pretty much terrible at calling every animal. I'm more of a get in the path of it than I am a bring it to me kind of guy. But either way, instead of just being a uh, review video that goes by the looks and feel and sound to the ear of a human, we're gonna go see if we can find some deer and see how they react to it. Hey guys, so it's six o'clock in the morning. I'm very tired. I gotta work tonight, so I can't be out long. We're gonna go try to find some deer so that way we can test out this deer call on some actual wild deer. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do a review video on a deer call and actually test it on wild deer. So I figured this would be kind of cool. Hopefully we find some. So I the camera on just in time. When I first pulled up on this field, there was two does and two fawns. And I don't know where that darker spot is. And when they saw the truck, they immediately went into the tulip. So we're gonna go up to the end of the field, get downwind, and try calling, see if we can bring them back up to us. Eh. 
So is it possible that I just happen to choose the correct side of the field to go to and do my calling? Yes. That is definitely 100% possible. But it's also possible that they came out because I chose to do a fawn call and it triggered the maternal instinct of those does. Absolutes are kind of hard to come by when you're hunting. I'm going to choose to say that the call works. And as such, I'm going to recommend it. Now, if you want to get that call for yourself, I'm going to drop a link in the description below this video. If you want a chance to win your own for free, I'm going to give you that chance as well. If we can get this video to 100 likes by August 15th, it's a little less than a week away, I'm going to give one of these away. If you want to get entered into that giveaway, all you have to do is like this video, be subscribed to this channel, and drop a comment down below saying you want in, saying something. Just drop a comment down below. Then on the 16th, I'll do a live stream for the drawing. So thank you guys for watching. Be sure to hit that like button. Drop a comment down below to get entered. Please subscribe to the channel. It's obviously kind of important to me. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.